Good morning, my friends. So, today we were talking a little bit about the Chinese New Year's, right around that time of year, and about some of the things that happened during that celebration, how one of those things was the creation and hanging of paper lanterns. So, we're going to create a paper lantern. Now, to do that, we need a few things. We need our paper that we're going to work with, of course. We need a straight edge. We need a pair of scissors. We need our trusty number two pencil. And we need a slightly special media for this one. We need some CPCs or construction paper crayons. These, you use these, these work the same as a regular crayon. Nothing different there. The difference is that the pigment, what they use to make them have a color, the pigment in these is really, really, really strong. It's really potent, really bright, really vibrant. And what that means is that these colors will show up really well on a colored piece of paper like the one we're working with. Now, this is a little bit different because for, for once, I don't want you to, we don't want to write our names as soon as we get it. We want to get our paper. We want to start off with our straight edge. We're going to take that straight edge, we're going to put it all the way down at the bottom. I'm going to turn, we need to turn our papers when we use a straight edge because you don't ever, ever, ever want to reach over the ruler to draw a line. We'll come right down that side. So I'm going to make sure I got that all the way onto the edge and then I'm going to make a line. Make sure I hold my ruler down in the middle so it can't spin or twist or pivot on me. So there's one and I'm going to turn my paper again and I'm going to do the exact same thing on the other side so that we have two lines just like that. So now we need to flip our paper over so that our lines that we made are touching the table. I'm going to we'll grab them, put one hand down here to hold that still. Use my other hand and I'm going to grab that part right there and I'm going to bring that over just like so. Okay. So now I can open that back up. Down here at the bottom, this is where we want to write our names. And then up at the top, we're going to use a construction paper to write this phrase. Gong, Shi, Fa, Sati. Which means wishing you a happy and prosperous new year. Um, so after that, now we are going to do a drawing in this part. Um, but we're going to do that separately from the video because it changes. So what we want to do, pretend for me, put on your imagination caps and pretend that we've already drawn a picture right here. So what we want to do is we want to fold that so that we have our picture and our phrase on the outside. We're going to take our scissors at that point. We're going to hold our paper by the crease. So we're going to make sure that it opens at the top, kind of like a taco. And what we want to do is just cut in a very straight line. And we want to cut and we want to stop cutting. And as always, when we cut with a pair of scissors, we want to make sure of a couple things. One, notice there's a small hole and a large hole. Make sure that our thumb goes into that small hole. The rest of our fingers go into the large one. And when we cut, we make sure that our thumb is always on top. And then we want to cut from the bottom up to that line we've made. All the way up. Now, we need these cuts to be straight. If you have them going off to the side or at an angle, it's going to mess up our finished product a little bit. So we're going to take our time here. We don't need to be in a hurry. Take our time. Make sure that we are making our cuts straight. And also, definitely make sure you stop cutting when you get to that pencil line. Because if you don't, you're going to cut a big chunk of your lantern off. Now, it might still work depending on where you accidentally cut it off at, but it won't work as well and it won't look as good. All right, almost done here. Now, when you get all the way to the end and you're done cutting, at that point, you need to raise your hand and let me know that you are done with that step. Because when you do that, I will come with the stapler 
and we'll roll that thing over and there's our paper lantern. Good luck to you everybody and happy arting.